Dan Blitz Bilzerian has earned himself the title as the king of Instagram, boasting 23 million followers on the app. Not only does he show off plenty of bucks and babes, he's also showing off his Gulfstream 4 jet, his chrome plated 1965 AC Cobra, his white Fisker Karma, and like any other world famous celeb, he's got a Lamborghini Aventador. And the best of all his sweet rides is his six wheeled Brabus G63 AMG. Energy. Dan lives in a gated community in the Hollywood Hills, kicking up his feet in a $3 million party pad. When Dan hits up Las Vegas, he stays in a $5.1 million mansion and is said to have another home in the beach town of La Jolla near Mexico. He's got plenty of other lavish toys, including enough guns to start his own war. He's got two goats, his beautiful smush ball, and a $800,000 Richard Mile timepiece. When interviewed in July of 2014 by Howard Stern, Dan Bilzerian admitted that his net worth was around $100 million. Take a listen for yourself. They say you're worth like $100 million. Is that close to where your, worth, your net worth is? Something like that. So I've won $50 million roundabout in the last 12 months or so. Now various online sources including Celebrity Net Worth, they estimate his total net worth to be around $150 million. So the question is, how did he do it and where is all this money coming from? Well there's plenty of speculation surrounding Dan's financial come up. How did you get all your money originally? Um, so that's another common misconception. Um, He's been candid that some money was put away in a trust fund by his corporate takeover specialist father turned equity and tax fraudster. There's also his big poker playing wins and of course the man has managed to utilize his online fame to turn a profit. I'm going to walk you through his financial come up, where the money is coming from and what he spends it on here for you on The Rich Life. My name is Mike McCredden and I got a question for you guys. How tall is Dan Bilzerian? The answer will be at the end of this video. Now let's roll that intro. Dan Bilzerian was born on December 7th, 1980 and grew up in Tampa, Florida. His old man Paul Bilzerian made it big in the 80s and little Dan grew up in a 10 plus bedroom mansion which came complete with an indoor basketball court, a batting cage, lakefront views, a swimming pool and a water slide. Dan's father was convicted of fraud in 1989 and was sentenced initially to 4 years in prison. He ultimately served 13 months and now resides in St. Kitts. There are plenty of sources out there who have looked over the legal documents pertaining to Paul Bilzerian's bankruptcy judgment and they pegged Dan's trust fund at 11.96 million to be split between him and his younger brother Adam. Now I got no idea when this trust fund became accessible so let's just imagine that Dan cashed in after he had already made bank for himself in poker and on Instagram. Now Dan's personal life story is a fascinating one and I'm going to walk you through it in an updated before their famous video. This rich life is more about his financial come up. After getting discharged from the military Dan had some money coming in while he was attending the university of Florida. His younger brother had gotten big into poker and Dan started spending what money he had on games. I was playing in college, I was playing like some online stuff. I had a couple of fraternity brothers that were real into it. That's how I started. I, I went broke um, my sophomore year. Following going broke, Dan then had to sell some possessions, mainly guns, to earn himself 750 bucks. He then took that money and gambled on a boat until he was up 10,000. Then he took that 10k to Las Vegas and played three weeks straight at the Bellagio until he went home with 187k. Still in school, there were weeks where Dan was pulling in 90,000 a week. Needless to say, he never finished his degree. Dan's poker days have been well documented, both the good and the bad. Dan won 10.8 million playing a single game of heads up no limit hold'em at stakes of 5,000 to 10,000. After winning he immediately took a private jet to Mexico to celebrate with some babes, of course. His most successful tournament win was in the 2009 World Series of Poker where he placed 180th and took home 36,626 bucks. He also flipped a coin for 5 million and lost. How did you feel after that? I was like whatever. You know. At the 2013 World Series of Poker, he decided to put up 20% of the $10,000 buy-in for Jay Farber. When Farber won $5 million, Dan Bilzerian was able to claim $1 million of the cut. Outside of poker, Dan has found other ways to make money. As an actor, he's appeared in the films Olympus Has Fallen, Lone Survivor, The Other Woman, Wars Dog, and The Equalizer. You didn't see him, did you? This is him. <laughs> Dan 
Bolzarian was baking bank and enjoying the perks of this lifestyle, well he decided to post to Instagram photos of the shit he thought was cool. Getting started in 2014, his account quickly climbed to 1 million followers. By 2015, he already had amassed 6 million, and then he was crowned the king of Instagram. Dan has suggested that he could easily make between 10 to 15 million dollars a year if he accepted all the offers that came to him to post to Instagram. Instead, he uses the app to promote his various business ventures, including a vape line, his support for Dollar Beard Club, and he's got his own animated show. Alright, now let's get into the fun part and take a look at what he spends his money on. Dan has claimed that he has 20 employees, including 3 assistants and 3 chefs. As for company, well, I don't know what the deal is, but good for him. Dan's main party pad, the one notorious for his A-list parties, is located in the Hollywood Hills and is valued at $3 million. It's been rumored that Dan rents or leases the property to a price tag of 35 k a month and he's getting it off Wong Jing Long, one of the richest men out of Singapore. Here his neighbors include the likes of Leonardo DiCaprio and the billionaire son Sammy Boy Nazarian. The house has a sunken living room with 278 degree views over the city, a pool that hangs out over the hillside, cash counting machines, poker tables, and babes apparently in every corner. Dan is posted online about another home in La Jolla, a beach town near Mexico, and then of course there's his crash pad in Las Vegas. Now back in the day, Dan was living in an apartment at the Panorama Towers. Um, yeah, I'm kind of a homebody, you know, sit on the couch. Facebook, you know, photo poker or something. In more recent years, Dan has been partying at a $5.1 million mansion, which comes complete with five beds, nine baths, and comes with a pool and hot tub. It's also got a fit pit, whatever the hell that is, underground parking, a built-in backyard grill and bar. Also, there is a secure gun vault that appears to be able to hold up to like a thousand guns. There are other pieces of property, including a mansion in Montana that Dan picked up for a cool $1.7 which I got a really funny feeling was Mary Swanson's house in Dumb and Dumber 1. Or Dumb and Dumber, the original. Dan's other purchases include his pet goats named Zeus and Beatrice. Now a typical goat costs anywhere from $35 to $300, but Dan's goats enjoy the finer things in life, sleeping on $700 blankets. For real. His Persian cat smush ball would have cost him around $500, bucks. and when it comes to transportation, it's hard to peg down what exactly Dan Bilzerian owns, because he's got a whole lot of toys. His Gulfstream 4 jet is valued at $41 million as of 2015, and apparently the inside is all custom tailored. The dude posts enough pics inside and flies frequently enough that I'm thinking that he does in fact own this private plane. I mean, he's got his own logo on it, and that's not something you can just add for an Instagram post, right? He's got his chrome plated 1965 AC Cobra worth $1.6 million. His white Fisker Karma, which remarkably sold for only $103K, was scooped up by various celebrities. He's also got a Lamborghini Aventador, a Range Rover, and then there is the Dan Bilzerian Batmobile, a six wheeled Brabus G63 AMG worth $625K. Now Dan once tweeted, my greatest fear is that someone will break in and I won't be able to decide what gun to shoot them with. Now I don't know what every gun costs, but his 20mm anti-tank gun, that alone would cost them three to six thousand dollars. So they don't come cheap, thank god. Dan spends his fortune on all sorts of random stuff. He once announced that he would spend $16,000 a year drinking nothing but coconut water. He's also got a hard on for stem cell therapy, which costs thousands per procedure. And uh, I don't know what he's doing it for. Perhaps it's his injuries from his days of training, or maybe it's because of his sex capades. I got no idea. <laughs> my, se my sexy ass nurse is cleaning me up. I'm just going to do a few more fucking injections in my spine, and then I'm good to go. When it comes to fashion, Dan keeps it low key, often opting to rock army shorts and a black tee. He has been spotted rocking an $800,000 Richard Mile timepiece, and he has another one, an Odd Mars Puget, which set him back 300k. Although there are a ton of people who hate on Dan Bilzeri, and you got to admit that the man is living the alpha male dream. The only thing money can't buy are a couple extra inches. 
because he only stands at five foot nine. Now let me know who you want me to document next on The Rich Life. This was episode three, season two. And the comment section, it fills up pretty quickly because there's a lot of you. So the best way to get a hold of me is via Instagram or Twitter. Also, a lot of you guys have been asking for The Rich Life of Michael McCrudden, which will be nothing like Dan Bilzerian. It's not bad, but it's not like that. Anyway, we might do that when we hit two million subscribers. All right, guys, I'll see you in another video. Boom!